Okay, so for the craft I chose for a color of his own, I decided to make a watercolor chameleon. I got these free printouts on Pinterest and I'll leave the link below for you guys to print your own out. And I'm just gonna make now a, my little watercolor chameleon. You can make it any color you like. I'm just doing kind of like the front cover of the book where he's many colors, but you can either choose a color of your own or you can pick one from the book. All right, and there you have it. These are my two little chameleons from A Color of His Own. Hi, everyone. So today for Purplicious and Too Purply, I decided to make purple Play-Doh, and it's a no-cook Play-Doh. So I'm gonna tell you how to make that, and you make it with grape Kool-Aid to color it. So that's pretty exciting. It so what I've been doing is I'm sifting my flour. And you need two and a half cups of flour. along with your flour, you're gonna add to it a half cup of salt, and three tablespoons of cooking oil. And then you can either add one or two packets of Kool-Aid, so I'm just gonna do one for right now and see how I like the color. So you're gonna go ahead and give this a mix first. Okay, now you're gonna go and add a cup of very hot water. So almost bring water to a boil. I just microwaved it until it was almost boiling. And now you're gonna mix that in.
And once it feels cool enough, you can start kneading the mixture with your hands. Once you feel like it's all well mixed, you can go ahead and play with it. And to store it, just keep it in a container in the refrigerator. So you can play with it some more, some other days. And it smells really good. It smells like grape Kool-Aid. Hope you have fun with this one. Hi boys and girls. For Silverlicious, I decided to make a craft that is kind of helpful for your sweet tooth since she lost that one it's an edible fluffy slime so what you'll need is white chocolate pudding you need at least two boxes of these cornstarch and water so you begin by mixing the dry ingredients together so it's a third cup of white chocolate instant pudding. Okay. And then one cup of cornstarch. So I'm just gonna mix the dry ingredients together. And then add a third cup of water. It's gonna be crumbly for just a little bit. And then I'm gonna add some food coloring. I got this neon food coloring that includes pink, so I thought pinkalicious. I'm gonna use some pink food coloring. So I'm gonna just put a few drops in see what the color looks like. So once it's this clumpy, you want to start kneading it as well to really mix it together. So mine is definitely too sticky right now. <laughs> so what you have to do if it gets too sticky, I'm gonna put some cornstarch. So you want equal parts of cornstarch in the pudding mix again into the bowl. And then keep kneading from there.
This one's by far a lot more messier than the Play-Doh. <laughs> so I'm just gonna continue on doing this until it's a good con consistency. Okay, and there you have it, your edible fluffy slime. So you guys can eat it, but the recipe says you probably, it's probably not gonna taste that good since it's very corn starchy, but it smells like white chocolate. So it smells delicious. <laughs> I'll leave all the links below so you guys can check out the websites that has all the ingredients and directions on it, okay? I hope you guys have fun with all of these crafts. It was a fun time making them for you. Have a good week, guys. Bye.